Federal leaders are now putting plans in place to make it easier for us to get tested if we do have the coronavirus. Senator Ben Cardin led a discussion on the coronavirus with Maryland public health experts at the University of Maryland Medical Center today. WMAR 2 News Eddie Kadem shows us what's being done to streamline the process as scientists quickly work out a vaccine. Rising concerns over the coronavirus have people flocking to doctors to get tested. I think every model that we look at tells us that there will be increased pressures on the acute health care uh, services that we provide across the state of Maryland and getting the needed resources so that we can be ready as the demand increases to be able to serve the health care needs of our communities. United States Senator Ben Cardin was flanked by top health care specialists for a roundtable discussion. One of the main focuses, federal funding that trickles down to the states. At the national level, we passed eight point three billion dollars of federal assistance about two billion of that's going directly to the states right now the only way to get tested is to go through your local health department that is a process that has lots of steps and takes time Cardin says by the end of the week 2500 kits that will equate to 1 million tests will be distributed from the federal government to private labs taking the burden off of the health departments across the country. Your doctor will be able to make arrangements with the lab to have that test done, and that day the results can be known. That's going to be very important to help stop the spread uh, of this disease. Cardin says labs are making progress on a vaccine, but people shouldn't expect it to help this current outbreak. We've appropriated about $2 million for the research, so let me make this clear. We are uh, very optimistic about a vaccine. It will not help us for this season. The earliest we'll have a vaccine available to the general public will be 2021. In Baltimore, Eddie Kadem, WMAR 2 News.